Hello my friends, welcome back. It's episode 90. Oh, this will undoubtedly be another difficult battle, so... Well, one nice thing is that everyone's got this uh, immunity to poison, so... Valerie, why are you not holding anything? Hmm. Weird. This must be a graphical glitch. Here they come, boys. Charge! Oof. Ah, perfect. Well, so far, so not too difficult. Oh. one right here. Oh, he got tripped. Sucks to be you. Oh! Oh, the music's changed. When the portal opens wide and there's an evil fae inside, that's the moray. <laughs> mm, looks like they all survived my... My willpower strike. Let's curse them with a prayer. Go, Doge, go! I knew you could handle it. How are we doing for haste? Seven rounds, loads of time. I would totally love to baneful polymorph her, but I bet she resists it. Yup. Get her! Um. Ok, 
Can't do that. Thundering drums is not going to get the job done either. I suppose we can go around heroism. Giving people the whole heroism. Oh, I think a controlled fireball would be perfect right now. Okay, that did basically nothing. Get in there, Doge. She's probably resistant to this. No! Okay, well now I know exactly what to do. Good. Let's cut away her mirror images. Scream in their faces! Oh, damn it. That did not work. Okay, that got some damage in. She managed to get a mirror image back up. Oh, the doge got her! And the horse her summons rode in on. firing. Oh, right. That was easy. A level three ring of protection. It is indeed. Okay, <clears throat> that should stop the stat damage. And now we await the start of the next chapter. To the throne room! anything else to do here. 
But I suppose what I'll do is I'll save just before I push through a rank up, just in case something weird happens and I take massive stat damage. Next development in seven days and three hours. Okay, let's see if I can just burn some time. Okay, so you do have to actually do that event. Even if you go to the bald hilltop and slay the leaders of the invasion, do this right now. Okay, we'll come back to this plot when it turns up. This time, the disaster did it. Oh, for crying out loud. Right. So we have to do that event. Even though it doesn't make any sense, it should just it should just disappear. How far is he into researching the nature of curses? Like fourteen days. Fix it. Okay, there we go. Done. Now we can support the treasurer's endeavors. Level 5 economy! Wow, that was a fail. Okay!
the counselor could be leveled. But anyway, the uh, the next quest is starting now, so Let's go and do all this throne room stuff, then we'll set up our advisors to look after events, and then we will go out and start questing. We have a letter! Lady Eldori asks you to head to Varnhold at once. Then the letters suddenly ceased. Germandi Aldori seeks allies with anyone who has proven to be trustworthy, even if only a little. Considering that Varnhold is the closest thing to an outpost on the east edge of the River Kingdoms, it's also useful for her. <clears throat> a riot, rebellion, but if that were the case there would be refugees. Whatever happened there, it must have been sudden indeed. Judging by Eldori's letter, the silence doesn't seem voluntary. We did it! Another attack has been repelled, and the barony is stronger than ever. I'm a keeper of stories, your grace, and I have amassed a respectable collection over my long life. You know that failure dialogue that we saw earlier? Probably no one's ever read that before. <laughs> I mean, you just wouldn't accept that kind of damage. If it doesn't curse, then what could it be? It's the same adversary that was behind the bloom. It's obviously the friggin' flower girl who's being manipulated by the Lantern King. I mean, we saw a scene that basically spelt that out. I think it is the work of some fay. I recognize their hand. Next. little more acid oil. Thank you, Mr. Bokken. This time, the disaster didn't hit us, but our neighbors. Varnhold, a small town east of our barony, had been deserted in an instant. Get ready for anything. Okay. Truly, the next part of the story has kicked off. Well, we've done well in the interim, in terms of getting rank ups. I think the rank ups stop at 10 or something, so we've probably gained about half of them. Which is not bad at all. Wait, what the hell is now? What? Why am I suddenly in the other world? Okay, this is weird. Where are you rushing off to, my hound? To face your own death? 
Why am I here? You're trying to kill me again. Not today. Believe it or not, but I came here without evil intentions. I've been watching you, my hound. You've escaped my trap. You've destroyed my beautiful Everbloom flower. Such a strong will to live in such a fragile, mortal creature. Once, long ago, I am the web itself. The moment you took your first step on the road of the Stolen Lands, there was a time when I used to ask myself the same question. Oh, okay. I and my thousand breaths ever done to them. Why had I to endure this? You were wrong to think that your problems began with you. The ever-blooming flower was created long before your barony was founded. I prepared my weapon long in advance. Having no idea what I would turn it against. Everything has a price. Thousands of lives must be turned to dust for a single act of forgiveness. Yeah, I mean... We already know this. How? Well, there's no point in asking. My untamed homeworld has many miracles to offer. One can never know what they will reveal. Or to whom. So... What do you think of the proud, bitter, fallen nymph now, my hound? You want to aid the storm that strikes you and your lands. Hell, why? Though I do not want to know. You will help me either way, voluntarily or involuntarily. We just want to kill the With Lantern King, because he's obviously evil. Names can be weapons in capable hands. You've no need to know my name. No need. I can answer, but will you believe me? I have nothing to do with it. But I know who is responsible. I won't tell you, though. Why shouldn't the mistress visit her pet? Farewell, my hound. You have no idea what powers you've awakened, and now you voluntarily rot. Wow, you sure do bark a lot. Villains vent their frustration when they're losing. Okay, that's an exit there. How the hell did that get selected? Okay. Doesn't seem like there was much else to do here except listen to her vent her frustrations. You know, it's like, it demeans the story doing stuff like that. Seeing flashbacks from the past and kind of piecing it together from that was interesting in its own way. <clears throat> but then it's kind of like, yeah, just in case, you know, you don't have a brain in your head, let us slowly and painfully explain everything to you. Just in case you wanted to know more. Would you like to know more? Okay, we're back. To the pub. To trigger the Technic League quest before we leave town. And I also need to assign tasks in the throne room before we go anywhere.
I wonder where you can actually read the name of the pub. Since you changed the name of the pub. The Bear Rug Inn. Wow, that was... That was bright. Oh, we've definitely clicked on the right dude. He finally granted me my freedom. He promised me a lot of money, enough to get me to five kings mountains and then some, if I do the simple task for him. Find out if a half elf, elf named Octavia and a half orc named Rigongar were living in the capital, and if so, where they could be found. Looks like a trap. Of course it's a trap. That's a trap! We have a simple way of dealing with spies. He's a wizard from the Technic League. Uh, what should I do with this guy? Oh, let's just stick with the neutral choice. But he knows that he knows, but does he know that we know that he knows? And the thunder rolls! <laughs> I really hate this. I really hate this, uh, this logic chain. But does he know? But does he know that he knows? But does he know that I know that he knows that he knows? Start to make it stop. Let's go ahead and set up our kingdom tasks before we run off to adventures. like loading to get to loading to get to loading to get to loading there must be a better way to do this but anyway okay lots of people we can throw at that problem Okay, now everybody is doing something.
doubles movement speed on mountainous terrain. Interesting little project. And then there's just this trade agreement one left. Some curse research. Okay. We're sort of running out of rank ups to do as well, so I guess my suggestion now is what I need to do is uh, level up stats basically to make rank ups available, and that's gonna just that can be done very easily by just building. Rank ups are available. The loyalty rank up is available, that's about it. In the small baronies, the high priest covers the matters of the arcane and will assign a magister when the divine rank reaches four. I guess pushing up my divine score would be the way forward. We just have we have plenty of opportunity to actually level uh, whatever stats we wish. Why is the dog here? <laughs> Ikundo's dog is just floating in the middle of this town like a giant monster. Affects Alchemist Laboratory, Herbalist's House, Magic Shop, Nethesis Library, School. Miss Laboratory is not something I can build here. Herbalist's house is plus one to arcane when adjacent to a shrine. Plus one to divine when adjacent to a shrine. Okay, if we put the school here, next to the shrine, and then if we put another shrine in there... <clears throat> we can magnify... our capabilities. I'm gonna do a little bit of investment. I really don't need military, it's like my biggest stat. Hmm. 
Hmm, I guess you're not allowed to build another shrine. Yes, you are. Halflings Brewery. Yeah, I'm not really that interested in that. Okay, we should put that down. The cost escalates, and I think the game, and you know, they understand. Yeah, it's you know, it escalates because you know the way you can multiply these bonuses together. Plus one when adjacent to a monument. Sure, why not? Let's also build a monument. Library? Maybe a library? Guess it's not possible to put a library here at the moment. That also provides plus one when adjacent to a shrine. Sure, why not? Okay, that should help rank up our points a bit. Maybe replace some of the damage that we did to ourselves. Yeah, I think I want to get Divine Rank 4 next, but obviously we're, we're in the questing phase of the game now, but Divine Rank 4 is going to allow me to appoint yet another advisor, which will hopefully keep things rolling forward. Just auto stack those. Weird. Okay, can't stack them even though they're the same item.
toolkit of spells here. That's weird. I left the throne room and it didn't... It didn't ask me to uh, put items away, which is kind of annoying because I actually wanted it to do that. Maybe if I'd selected the other option just gone straight to the world map. I'm carrying a few unnecessary bits and pieces, but I will. Wand of Prayer. Eleven free casts of prayer. Eleven free casts of good hope. Acid fork. Can Octavia learn that? Yep. I don't know where we picked that up. And we also picked up Disintegrate. That's good times. Um, Disintegrate is a really good spell. Or at least... I remember it being a really good spell. I also remember it being a very high level spell. Sweet! It's transmutation as well. Any creature struck by the ray takes 2d6 points of damage per cast a level to a maximum of 40d6. Any creature reduced to zero or fewer hit points by the spell is entirely disintegrated, leaving behind only fine dust. Disintegrated creatures' equipment is unaffected. A creature or object that makes a successful fortitude save is partially affected, taking only 5d6 points of damage. That is a very nasty spell. Okay, there's a kingdom alert for some reason. Let's just double check that before we go to Varnhold. Trade guard. This settlement can be upgraded to the next level. Okay. And so we clicked the button. I'm 
Is that it? Okay, that was it. That was the alert. Please come here and click this button. You've clicked the button. Good job. Now leave. <laughs> it couldn't be it couldn't be a more demeaning task if it tried. Should have just done just should have just done that automatically. Okay, there is a quest at Talon Peak too, so let's go this way and see if the entrance to Talon Peak is along this path. Kingdom alert. Fine, I'm quite close to the barony. Let's very quickly have a look at this kingdom alert. Oh, new events have appeared. Greedy tax collector is back. Who else could do this? Storyteller will be back in a couple of days. Alright, it's nothing important. Ah, stop. Ugh. Way to Varnhold to keep getting distracted. No fear, for your time has come. Priests of Lamash too have their own paths. Ah, oh, we're ready for curse.
Okay, you cursed me with youngness. Well, I'm sure that will lead to trouble there. We're supposed to be going to Varnhold! Okay, but we are out of time. So, that is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.